I have no doubt that some of you just love the look of the stone and think it would be a crime to change it, but I just don't love it. So I'm going to change it. I tried to research the best product to use for something like this, and I decided that grout would be the best option, but the only thing I could find in my hardware store was one for small grout lines. So I landed on a mortar instead. Did they make a mistake? I guess we'll find out. I called in all my besties to come and help because I knew this would take me a million years to slather this all on by myself. But with all of us working, it only took about two hours. The stone was super porous and the texture just needed to chill out. So the mortar helped with filling in all of those holes and giving the stone a much softer look. Why didn't I just paint it? Well, because the paint wouldn't have filled in all of those holes. Paint alone, I think, would have looked terrible. After it had a day or so to dry completely, I grabbed a sample of my siding and took it in to get color match because the color of the mortar was a super dingy white. I actually didn't even use paint. I just had a masonry primer tinted to save money, but also because stone will eventually break down if it can't breathe, so I didn't want to add a latex paint over it. It's now all cohesive and pretty, and just you wait until you see the whole house when it's done. I'm planning to give my garage and front door a huge makeover, we're getting a new roof because this one is probably like 500 years old, and I'll be adding some shutters, so stay tuned.